الحمد للہ رب العالمین صلی اللہ وسلم علی نبی محمد وعلی وصحبہ وسلم اما بعد احبت اللہ there was immense benefit that can be derived from the Shaykh, from Shaykh Rabi bin Hadi al Madkhali's advice on how to cooperate in Dawil Allah and important principles for the Da'i, for the person calling to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, that they should be grounded in those principles, that they should have ilm, that they need to have knowledge, they need to have fiqh fi deen. And part of that fiqh fi deen was outlined extensively <clears throat> by the Shaykh about the importance, of course, of having sincerity and following the Sunnah of the Messenger of Allah Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam and how to advise and deal with your brothers and sisters from Ahl Sunnah when they fall into error that we should be gentle with one another all of that conforms to the Sunnah of the Messenger of Allah Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam and all of that we should take to heart because that will benefit us in this life as well as the hereafter but it will especially benefit us in spreading the correct call to a, the, the call to the da'wah to Ahl Sunnah the Madhab of the Salaf the Minhaj of Salafi, Salafiyya all of this all of those Qawa'id and principles and Asul that the Shaykh mentioned are imperative for us to understand and practice that it's not necessary to quickly attack one another's honor. Not only is it not necessary, it's not permissible. And it destroys the Dawah. And it destroys the relationships between the brothers and sisters. And speak with knowledge. If you haven't studied with someone, then keep silent. Because there are so many people in this day and age, especially with the new uh, technologies of the, uh, of, of, um, with the internet, all the uh, the YouTube, the Instagram, Twitter, all of these uh, social media, forms of social media, the most ignorant of people can speak about the religion and taint the religion and criticize and accuse and lie and spread, spread uh, slanders and vilify people. That's easy to do now. You can do that from anywhere in your home. And with this danger comes the importance of understanding those principles. And not to let people like this cause discord and disharmony between Ahlul Sunnah. Ahlul Sunnah is one. The Muslims are one. We're one Ummah. Although we've broken into sects. And that needs to be corrected. That's not permissible. That's Muharram. As the Prophet Wasallam said, If tarakatil yahud ala itta wa sab'in farqa ila akhira hadith, when the Prophet Wasallam said, Men kan ala mithu ma kan ala alayhi wa ashabi, those, speaking about those people who are saved, the safe sect, those who are upon what I'm upon and my companions. That's what we want to strive to be upon. And part of that minhaj, minhaj rabbaniya, the minhaj nabuwa, is that we are gentle and kind with one another and your brothers and sisters that we can we can advise one another and not be hasty to make judgments and take one another off the da'wah to Ahl Sunnah likewise even gentle if, it, if, it, if it's necessary or uh, in general we should be gentle with Ahl Bid'ah even we shouldn't quickly be harsh and stern with the people or no one will ever accept the, the haq who's going to accept the haq if you've cursed them who's going to accept the haq if you make hajr of them who's going to accept the haq you know, if that's the first way you operate and, and with, with one another and this is absolutely imperative to understand that the shaykh laid it down very nicely if only we will take heed so beware of attacking your brothers and sisters even if they attack you it's not necessary for you to jump up and quickly refute them because they refuted you. Refute them because they don't agree with your, your, you on some issue. That's not necessary. 
It's not necessary. And don't make it personal. And then spread it to the youth. And we ask Allah the Almighty to accept our good and forgive our evil. And bless us with ilm al-nafi, ruskan tayyibu, amal al-mutakabini. Anything I said that was correct was from Allah Azza wa Jalla. Anything I said that was incorrect was from myself and the shaitan wa sallallahu wa sallam ala nabiyya Muhammad wa ala alayhi wa sahbihi wa sallam.